Hi! Oh my god! What's up? What's going on? Shake my hand. Shake it. Shake it. There it is. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm back. Um, uh, intro. 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 Got you. Okay. Hey, ho! Whoa. No. <laughs> no, you're not a hoe. You're probably very lovely. Gosh, don't it. Get it together, Jimmy. It's your girl, Jimmy. I'm back. Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh my, oh my, oh my god. Oh, 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 but guess what? I didn't. <laughs> I really didn't. Give me a second. I'll be right back. I didn't forget. I, I didn't forget. Young adults with rashes. That's what that is. Bruh. It's gonna be interesting. Yeah. That makes a lot of sense. Still don't get it though. What's going on, Jimsters? You sure go with the two fingers up? Girl, Jimmy. Okay, that's easy. Simple, easy. Sure girl, Jimmy. She, yeah. Uh. You know what? Just, just give me a second. Um, I'm gonna I'm just walk in over here. Just gonna, just gonna walk over here real quick. I'm gonna set you guys down right there. Okay, cool. All right, bye. See ya. Good night. long time for it and it's it's a uh, it's long overdue there's no watch here it's fine it's long overdue okay so here's my hair here is it here is it is here is it even English probably not but did you guys miss me or not <laughs> no all right cool okay so the last time you guys saw me let's see it was a long time ago all right it was quite a minute and I I had a high top you're probably like wait had had what past tense yes i had a high top okay so you guys know COVID's going on and all that stuff so i was in quarantine for a long long time and i had a lot of time to grow out my hair all right now before i explain what's going on under these locks here let me go all the way back all right cool so those of you who are new to my channel i have recently got lock extensions i put in lock extensions about a few months ago. I want to say it was six months ago. Last time I posted, I had lock extensions. Now, don't get me wrong. I love them. I love those lock extensions, but, all right. I thought that I thought that lock extensions were gonna be perfectly fine on my bald head, but I was wrong. <laughs> a few days after I got them, they were like hanging by a strand. Some were coming out. It was just a mess. So I decided to take them out and grow my hair a little bit more just so the lock extensions can have something to really like grasp. Another thing I did not like about these lock extensions was they were jet black. So I don't know if you guys can tell by that photo, but they're like really, really black. Like black, black. Like my hair is black, but that's like blacker than black, right? So you see my dilemma. Okay, cool. So that was a huge turn off. So I was just like, okay, see, starting over, it makes so much sense. Cause then I can go to someone else who can give me suggestions for other lock extensions that actually match my scalp. Is it so dang hard to get some sexy lock extensions, huh? Apparently. I talked to someone in New York and they do really good work. Like when I saw their work, I was just like, Wow, that's sexy. I was geeked. So I sent pictures of my hair to the woman and she literally gave me suggestions on all I had to do was grow my hair 
two or three more inches and then we're good to go. So I said, hey, we're in quarantine. Let's do it. Why not? I mean, I got nothing to do. I can look ugly if I want. So I grew it out a lot, like a lot, a lot. This is how it looked before because you guys probably don't understand the growth right now. See my high top? Mm, huh? Bald. All right. This is how it looks now. But before I show you, do not judge the mess. It looks a mess. I'm not gonna lie. It looks a mess. I didn't do anything to it. I just put two strands of twist in it. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, whatever. Here it is. This is how long my hair grew. Holy crap. This, look at the length. Can you guys see the length? Do I need to zoom in? I'll zoom in for you. This is the length. I have little rubber bands just hanging on them because they got so long and oh my god, my whole head is just like long AF now, wow. I could definitely get lock extensions now. So you guys see what I've been doing. Wow, I look like a crackhead. <laughs> this is literally probably six months of hair growth. I'm not kidding you. This is literally six months of new growth and it's insane. But I could definitely get some lock extensions now, right? I'm so excited. So I will definitely update you guys on when I get my new lock extensions installed. So just wait for that video because I gotta find somebody. It's quarantine, COVID, all this. Just wait for that video. And back to the update. I honestly can't believe I had my hair. I've had my hair. I've always had hair. I've had these locks for four years now. Four years. This is four years of work four years of blood sweat and tears it's been a it, it's it's been a it's been a real journey like i will say it definitely gets way easier the longer you have your locks like it gets easy like everyone's always just like but i completely understand that because literally the first month of me having dreadlocks i was just like yeah no this is not for me this is not gonna slide i a hey. no but thank god for hats because your girl made it through no guys like in the beginning your locks aren't gonna be where they're gonna be in four years from now so you never know you should just Try it out and just be patient and just get creative. You can get creative. Just do cool hairstyles and if you can't put your hair in any hairstyles, then hats are your best friend. Fedoras, baseball caps, I don't know, a shoe. You can use uh, anything, really. Yeah, don't use a shoe. I'm drunk. Okay. Now the method that I use for my dreadlocks is a very popular method that a lot of people start their dreadlocks with and it is the two strand twist method. Pretty much I literally two strand twisted my hair when it was about three inches. Like it was, it was this, this, this big. I don't know if I have any pictures but boom I'll show you literally just phases of how my hair looked to how it looks now. So you can see the comparisons and it, it, it's, it, it's different, it's different. That's why I'm saying like everyone should just really like just, just be patient. But I definitely recommend the two strand twist method. It's really convenient, really easy. All you need to do is just literally let time do its thing. There's a lot of methods out there for you, go look them up. <laughs> no, in all seriousness, if you guys want me to make a video on the different type of waist to lock, one type texture hair, I can definitely do that for you. <laughs> uh, I'm not a YouTuber. <laughs> I've been maintaining my dreadlocks by keeping them oiled. Now I am guilty. I don't oil them all the time. I oil them when I remember to oil them. So I don't do it all the time. So I'm not sitting here like, hey, you gotta oil, oil a little, little, little. So I'm not sitting here saying you have to oil your dreadlocks frequently. I mean, it's it'll be beneficial, yes, but who remembers, you know? It's, if you remember, hey, good for you, good for you. I usually use coconut oil for my hair. It's what I always have around the house, but there's a lot of oils that you can keep your dreadlocks very moisturized with, and it's like tea tree oil, there's argan oil, there's a lot of oil, even olive oil. Any oil that's very beneficial for you is beneficial for you. I know a lot of people is really scared of bleaching their dreadlocks and 
It is really scary, but your girl's a thug and I ain't scared. You feel me? Okay. I feel like if you want your hair a certain color, go for it. Just make sure you take care of it. That's all you have to do. You don't have to be scared. Just take care of it. And if you need help taking care of your hair, I can definitely give you guys pointers. Just comment below if you want a video of how to maintain bleach locks and I got you. Guys, look at my roots. They grew, they really grew in. Hold on, let me focus this. Wow, how do you focus? Oh, there it is. There it is. Look at those roots. Wowzers. They're very healthy. I recently oiled with coconut oil and you can see my scalp looks very moisturized. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> okay, whoa, okay. Go back to focus, there it is. So that's pretty much the gist of this update. Um, Got some baby locks, long locks, black roots, blonde locks. Am I done? Am I done here? Can I go? All right, cool. See you guys, bye. I'm just joking, y'all. Crying. Stop crying all the time. Gosh, I'm gonna do a proper outro. But I wanna thank you guys for coming back to my channel, the OG Gemsters. I miss you. I love you guys. You guys are freaking awesome. Something fell. I'll worry about that later. My new upload schedule will be every Saturday. So please stay tuned for videos every mother loving Saturday. No guys, but I am really going to be consistent. I have settled down. If you guys don't know, <laughs> your girl moved to California in Los Angeles, California. I'm here. It's true. This is it. It feels like LA. It feels like LA. I'm here. I'll make a separate video explaining the whole move to California from Texas to California. I'll explain it all for you guys. But just know that I am now settled down and we can get videos crack lacking. That I would never use that word again. I'm so sorry that you had to hear that. Cover your ears. Cover your ears. But thank you guys for watching this video. I really appreciate it. And all the new people, make sure you subscribe. Because I'm cool. I think I'm cool. So I think you guys should subscribe because you guys are going to see a lot of stuff about my dreadlocks. Ah, it's good to be back. But <coughs> my outro. Hold on. <coughs> I got this. Hold on. Here it is. Stay cool, stay fresh, and stay locked. Peace out. Oh my god, I did it. Bye, guys. See ya.